she had approximately 400 cc saline implants in. Um, the feel was not as authentic as a natural breast or the gummy bear implants, so we chose the Sientra Textured Round Cohesive Gel Implants. In my mind, those implants have been shown statistically to have the best performance of any implant on the market. They also feel great. So we went up from a 400cc implant to a 625cc moderate profile implant. We used the same inframammary incision that was used previously. We're a few months out now at least and you can see here it's healing really well. I can barely see a little line. It's beautifully concealed right where it creases. is. Um, we, when we show you the before and after pictures you'll see that the breast just didn't quite fit her frame optimally. Now she has very beautiful cleavage. One of the things that's also uh, key for our viewers out there is to remember sun protection. Okay, she's got this beautiful skin where the sun doesn't shine so much, but you see in the center here where most people do get a lot more sun, especially after breast surgery, they tend to reveal that area more. Um, it's really important to apply and reapply sunscreen and protect that as a valuable asset because it is. But for right now, I think we just want to admire the beautiful results from her gummy bear implant exchange up to the 625 cc moderate profile textured round implants. If you'd like to see more beautiful before and after pictures like these, hit the like and subscribe buttons.